Hey guys, it's me Annie and welcome back to another bookish video. So in today's video guys, I'm just basically gonna share with you where I buy my books. This video is actually very special because I decided to do this out of a desire to help Filipinos. I always hear them tell me that they want to read but they just don't know where to go. They don't know where to get cheap or affordable books because brand new books here in the Philippines are so expensive. Alright, so first I'll be sharing with you guys where I buy brand new books. So I buy brand new books at number one, National Bookstore and number two, Fully Booked. Now to those of you who are living in Metro Manila or in Cebu, you are so lucky. You're so lucky to have Fully Booked there because I love that bookstore so much. Fully Booked has a lot of really really good books that I cannot find anywhere in National Bookstore. One very good example of that is my Frederick Backman collection. Thanks to Fully Booked, I was able to discover such a nice author. He's amazing. I love his writing style. His stories make you laugh, but they also make you cry. And speaking about Fully Booked, I also got myself this Fully Booked discount card. It is so worth it to have this card because you get 10% discount forever, for a lifetime. So every single time you buy books, you get it at a discounted price. And lastly, I have a tip if you want to buy at Fully Booked or National Bookstore and that is wait for the sales. National Bookstore and Fully Booked, I think they have like a sale three times or twice a year, I'm not sure, but wait for it. It is so worth it. Now let's move on to the more interesting part. I'm going to share with you guys where I buy secondhand books. So the first place I go to if I want to buy secondhand books is called Book Sale. And there at Book Sale, I actually got my Hunger Games series. And as you can see, two of them are paperback and one is hardcover. <laughs> I guess that's the only downside if you buy from secondhand bookstores is that you don't get to choose. But that's okay, I don't mind. So yeah, I got a lot of my books from Book Sale. You just really need to be patient and looking for them. Another secondhand bookstore that I go to is called Books for Less. And some of the books that I actually got from Books for Less are my Mitch album books and my Nicholas Sparks books. So I'm only gonna show you guys some examples because I can't show you everything from my bookshelf. Well, of course, there are a lot of other secondhand bookstores here in the Philippines, but I'm only mentioning the ones that I've actually, you know, bought books from. But don't you worry, I will include in the description box below some of the other secondhand bookstores that I know. And now for the last part of this video, I'm gonna share with you guys where I buy my books if I choose to buy them online. So first, I join a lot of buy and sell groups on Facebook and I follow local booksellers on Instagram. So I'm gonna put in the description box below some of the groups that I've joined and also some of the people that I follow on Instagram. Instagram. And I was able to buy so many books because of this. Among those books that I got from joining buy and sell groups and following people on Instagram are my YA books. And I was even able to buy this baby right here because of joining those groups. The next thing that I do to buy secondhand books is that I download apps on my phone. Namely the OLX app and the Shopee app. There's actually another one, it's called Carousel, but I haven't tried buying from there yet. Well, these apps are just basically online selling platforms. If you don't want to download the app, you can go directly to the website. And it's just a place where sellers can post whatever they want to sell and buyers can just type in what they're looking for. And then in an instant, you can see a long list of those things. Well, in my case, I always go for books. And some of the books that I got from using these apps are my Percy Jackson series, my Heroes of Olympus series, and also the Kane Chronicles. So you guys know how much I love Rick Riordan and were it not for those apps, I would never have had his books. Well, I would, but I would have bought them for their full price and I don't have the budget for that. So you may be wondering how these groups or these apps work. Well, usually if you see an item that's being posted and you're interested in it, you can contact the seller directly. So I usually do that. I always make sure that I talk to the seller first because I want to see the condition of the book. And the seller would then take pictures of the cover, the spine, the pages, or anything else that you want to see. I always do this to make sure that the book is in good condition because they're secondhand after all. So then if I'm satisfied with a book, I would then proceed to buy it. So in the Facebook groups or in Instagram, I would usually meet up with a seller personally. So I would get the book and then give the money in exchange. But in one of the apps that I mentioned earlier, you can actually buy the books right there from the app itself. And what's so great about it is that if you reach a certain amount, 
Sometimes you don't even have to pay for the shipping fee. And that is the best thing ever. So as you guys can see, most of my books are secondhand. And I consider myself a book hunter <laughs> because I always look for good deals when it comes to books. And that, my friends, is how I support my hobby and my passion for reading. So those were the things that I do in the places that I visit whenever I want to buy books. So I really hope this video was helpful to you guys. Every single book that you see behind me, all of those were purchased through those things that I mentioned to you. So if you guys have any questions or anything you want to clarify, you can write them in the comment section below or message me directly on Instagram or in any of my social media accounts. So that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, hope you give it a big thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit subscribe for more bookish videos. Thanks again, guys, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!